Romans chapter 23 and 24 is what we are sharing today. I'm reading it in NIV. It says, For all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God, and all are justified freely by His grace through the redemption that came by Jesus Christ. You know where I'm heading today. Hello, my lovely people. How are you all doing? Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, wherever you are going to watch this from. How are you all doing in your respective countries where you are best? I pray and believe that you are all doing well in your endeavors, and I am coming live to you from Uganda. If you're my first time visitor, you are super, super welcome. And my returning subscribers, guys, every day I come out here to share with you amazing, amazing good news. And on this content for my new subscribers, I share the word of God. I break down big concepts in Christianity to smaller workable tips so that anyone can apply them. It is a matter of believing in your heart and things will start working for you. If you believe the word of God, it will bring you answers. It will bring you results. I also get to share topics that we never get a chance to ask in the service as the preacher is preaching. That time when you feel like I have a question here, you come and we ask them here and we get answers for you. We share, we grow one another in the Lord because this channel is about spiritual growth. We need to grow and enjoy these promises that we read in the Bible. What God tells us that you are blessed, we need to see that blessing. That he says you are rich, you need to see those riches. That you are the child of God, you need to move and you feel like, yeah, I am a real child of God. So those are the things that we share here for our benefit. And today we have read Romans chapter 3, verse 23 and 24. And it says, for all have sinned. Guys, there is no angel here. We are in flesh. Everyone has fallen short of God's glory. Everyone has sinned. Even before you sin, you are a sinner because you carry the sin of Adam. One man fell and the whole world was. That sin is counted on us. That's what this Bible is. In other words, saying, it is saying that all have sinned and fallen short of God's glory. I want to read it again. It says, for all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God and all are justified freely by his grace through the redemption that came by Jesus Christ. Now, of course, there are people who usually want to weigh sin, but the Bible says all have sinned. Whether you have done this or that or not done this or that, all have sinned. So, and I have a video about who is a sinner, who is a saint, how we are justified. I'll leave two videos linked for you to build up on this. But today I am sharing about how we are perfected by God himself. The Bible has said we are justified. We are all justified. How did it say? All are justified freely by his grace through the redemption that came by Jesus Christ. So God is in the business of justifying us every day. Every day God is working on us. God is continually mending us, shaping us, breaking and putting us, putting those broken pieces until we hold to be a, a good flower verse. You know that broken piece that you bring patching all the time, that is what he's doing every day, 
putting us until we are together, until you are whole, solid. You understand? So, it is not godly to judge someone and you're like, ah, that girl is a thief. She stole a pen in 2018. Eh, that girl is a gospel. No, as long as they are Christian, like they have accepted Jesus Christ as their personal Lord and Savior, everyone is a work in progress. So we are justified every day moving to perfection that God is leading us into. For instance, as you continue listening to the word that I share here every day, or you listen in to different Christian content here on YouTube, we have a chance that we have vast of them, but you must be keen that you are listening to a good word, the word that will construct you well. Because the Bible says that he is the word. The word is God himself. So he, every day as you listen in to these words, there is a change that is happening in you. As you continually watch these videos, they might be 10 minutes long, they might be 5 minutes long, but as you give yourself to the word, your attitude towards life is changing, your faith is growing every day as you listen in to Christine as she shares faith vlogs. You are like, okay, I need to build my faith. I need to build my inner man so that I am standing. As you listen in, your patience, if you have been an impatient person, as you listen in to a good word, your patience is growing. Your tolerance levels are growing. Your wisdom, you are deepening every day you learn a word that it, it is taking you deeper in god you understand so every day we are becoming better versions of ourselves why because god is in the business of perfecting us every day as he has said everyone has fallen in the flesh you will find no one in right order but as we give ourselves to the word every day we are being renewed to become better and better and that is why this verse is saying that we are justified freely by his grace it is by grace that we are being justified every day the person you met last year is not the same person the christian you met in 2012 is not the same christian now the person you met a year ago is now totally different because they have revolved by the word. The word every day is changing, especially if you are diligent, if you are giving yourself wholly to these things, they must work for you. Praise the Lord. So someone you met last week, the lady you met last week and you called a thief. Maybe today is no longer a thief and for you in your mind you kept with the old version of that person. So it is it is not good to keep record of wrongs of people. They are getting better every day so always cross check. Have they become better versions than calling them what they were? Maybe they changed. You understand so that was today's sharing yes this is how i am ending it guys continue giving just a simple like that is how youtube algorithm grows if you give a like youtube senses that this is a content that people are liking so they will leave it for other viewers and that way guys you are participating in spreading the gospel to the ends of the earth. So kindly do that for me. We are in it together. My purpose on being on YouTube is to share the good news, the gospel to the ends of the earth. So if you share, if you like, if you watch full length, all those things contribute to YouTube algorithm to recommend the videos to other viewers and that way you are also putting in the work and the bible says that our labors are not in vain we shall receive a reward my desire is to go to all nations 
to share the word and I will either come to you by cyber or I'll come physically and preach this good news to you. Praise the Lord. That is my divine purpose. That is what I am sold out to. Where they say I go for the gospel, I will dare go in. So stay blessed. Kindly also watch my lifestyle videos that I throw in here to break the routine of the word, the word. I always go out and bring you uh, daily vlogs of how we live life here in Africa, in Uganda. When I go to the countryside, I take you. When I travel outside Uganda, I take you along. So we are in this together for fun, for entertainment, but most of all, to share the love of God, to share with you this good news that you accept Jesus Christ as your personal Lord and Savior and you will have eternal life. As simple as that, guys. So we are going to end this episode with a short prayer. So let us bow our heads and pray. Heavenly Father, we thank you for today. We thank you for the word. And we thank you, O oh God, for the gospel of grace. We thank you, my Jesus Christ, for it gives us the hope. It gives us the life. We thank you, O oh God, that even while we were still sinners, you died for us. That is the love that you have given unto us. I pray, my Jesus Christ, that it will be a revelation to each subscriber of mine, to each viewer of mine. They will come to the understanding, to the knowledge of the truth of Jesus Christ, the love that you have become to us. I thank you, my God, for you are perfecting us every day. Our attitude towards life, our faith is growing, our wisdom is deepening by the word as we give ourselves holy into studying the word as we share every day every time that we make a video here we are learning i give you glory i give you honor and i, I thank you for the growth that we receive every day for the perfection every day we are becoming better and better people in the society i thank you i give you glory i give you honor in the mighty name of jesus christ i have prayed and believed amen 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 so stay blessed i'll definitely see you on my next one shalom adios bye bye for now